welcome to my workshop. This video is sponsored by Thunder Laser. And today we're going to start the process of engra HD engraving a photograph onto some material. Now we're going to start off with some fairly ordinary material which is MDF uh, and then we'll do some woods and then ending up with engraving into glass but we'll leave that for a, a video all of its own. So the first thing we need to do is to change the standard 2 inch lens to the HD or high definition lens. Okay so this is the high definition lens. Now the lens is approximately here um, and I would say that the focal distance of this is probably well, it's less than an inch. Okay, so it's, it's going to be a very, very fine uh, beam at the focal point. Um, not really sure how fine, but I'm saying it's, I'm thinking it's going to be extremely fine. So, to change this, what I'm going to do is just drop the table down a bit. And bring it forward a bit. Okay, so just pull this top clip down. That clip will come out very easily. Unscrew this. Take this out. If you notice there's a collar on here. I'll zoom you in a bit so you can see what's going on. Okay. So there's a you'll see that there's a collar on here. Uh, so you know it goes in the same position every time. So it's gonna line up with the automatic um, focusing. So now what you do with this is slide it not all the way up to the, the top, just a little bit down, like so. Alright, and squeeze him up there, put this pipe back in. Now what we're going to do is manual focus this. So this is a piece of material that we're going to, to use. I'm now going to bring the table up and I have a gauge supplied with this HD lens to get the right height off the material. Okay, so this is the gauge material. Don't put it underneath here and operate the, the uh, Z axis or the bed axis. Um, take it off some ways and we're going to come up close come up a bit closer than that in fact this is how it's going to come so what you do you put this underneath then unlock this Take the nozzle down so it just touches on the tip there. We'll lock it up there. Feels like a weak magnet when you put this underneath there, a very weak magnet. Okay, so that is the distance. Uh, I think that's probably about five millimeter, and the lens is here, so it's, it's it looks as though it's less than an inch focal distance. So now we can treat a photograph in Lightburn to 
Action the Gear.